Hello everybody, it's the Ash Heritor, and welcome back to Crusader Kings 3. We are picking up where we left off, with, uh, Grand Matriarch Ranisa going from Satrap to, well, Empress, basically. It's been a, uh, she's had a... capable reign, let's just call it that. She's getting up there in the years, she's 62 years old now. She is, however, still fine. Yeah. Inv reinvigorated friendship and athletic. Yeah, she's still going strong. She's probably going to live for quite some time. And our heir, Cyrus, here. He'll, uh... He'll be ready. Once the time comes to, uh... Claim the throne. Now. Let's see here. What are we going to do today? Well, I think, I think it's time we make some conquests. I think it's time we get some of these holy sites. So we can't grab this one, because it's in the control of our allies. The Hemavati are our friends. But, there's holy sites down here. We need to head in that direction. Khorasan was once ours, and it needs to become ours yet again. Unfortunately, the ruler of Khorasan does not want to become a vassal. We're gonna have to do something about that. We're gonna have to do something about this guy as well. In fact, let's do something about this guy right now. It's, you know, it's a county. What's he gonna do to us? He's got no allies, so we're just gonna conquer him. Alright. Set up a, uh, a rally point right here in... In, uh, that Merv? Yeah, that's Merv. Um... Let's just raise a local army. And our men-at-arms. The visit. I am passing through Karashar, the capital of my high almoner, Shah Gurak, when I receive an invitation to visit his castle. As I arrive, he welcomes me with a frown and a tour. One thing that strikes me is the place is full of unfinished projects. Unfinished projects, huh? I'll stay a while. Maybe I can help him out. I think I've had this event come up before. You have to do, like, a bunch of things. Um, I think I can help out with the dining hall. Or the books. We're gonna help out with, uh, the books. It's important. Okay, apparently... Do I- do I really need to raise the entire legion? I don't want to raise the entire legion. Okay, we're gonna send these guys, and then we're gonna disband them. You guys go away. I, I don't need... I don't need to be spending that type of money for a comparatively small army. Like, I don't think... Okay, now what? Yeah, we, let's help out with the dining hall. Alright, let's, let's disband these as soon as we can. They're, they're, they're taking up some uh, of my, my precious money, my god. The chest of gold is very unguarded, let's see. Come on. Hurry up. Alright, let's speed up the speed up the pace. Uh, remember guys. Leave a uh, leave a like for this video if you're enjoying it. Likes help the video get uh, noticed by the YouTube algorithm, which in turn gets it more views, which can in turn get it more likes, which in turn can get me more subscribers, which will help my channel grow, which would help me out a lot. So anybody that has been liking the videos as we go through, thank you so much. And, uh, yeah. Now, yeah, carrying on. Oh my god, it takes forever. I don't need this many men. <laughs> Can't I just summon, like, a, a small army? Yes, lose some stress. Great. Can we do it now? Can we disband the armies? Thank you. And then we can disband them. Great. Now we are not losing money. And I'm no longer overwhelmed by stress. All of this is good. Let's massacre this little force. Wonderful. We've taken the guy hostage. Thank you. I will enforce my demands right now. Wow, what a war. Just done instantly. Okay. This is now mine. Now, what is it de jure part of? It's part of the Duchy of NASA. NASA. Um. NASA, you say. Hmm. Interesting. I'm sure it's not that NASA. I don't think that was around then quite yet. 
Where else can we invade? Where else can we invade? There's Rai here. Um, Gur? Thought it was like I thought it was Hur with like a ch, and I was like, hey, wait, that's in Switzerland. And this this may be mountainous, but I don't think this is in Switzerland. I think we're a little closer to like this Afghanistan. I don't think it's Afghanistan. I think this is still Iran. Um, <clears throat> all right. Could be wrong, though. Do we invade this guy? Who are you allied to? You're allied to a Marzaban. Psh! No! My sister died. And my friend died. At the same time. Okay, two days apart. Why you do this? You're not allowed to die. She died from complications of self-flagellation. This is why we don't do this, people. Ugh. Everyone. Shahanshah encourages chivalry. Ah, very good. He's, uh, he's doing well. Well, um... I need to work off some stress. Let's be sweaty for a little while. That's fine. She's 62. She's still running. It's all good. We need to avoid the stress when possible. Uh, I'm sitting on an unreasonable amount of money. I should probably do something with it. <coughs> uh, the plague still has me. Let's build, uh, upgrade the trade ports to get ourselves even more money. And then we can work on our men at arms. But what are we, uh, what are we gonna take? We gotta take some land. Let's, let's take this. Although, man, I'd really like you to submit. I'm just saying. We could get him to submit. He's just a satrap. But then we should probably take this territory. Who are you allied to? Hey. Really? Base reluctance has claimant on to the Arsariad Empire. You are of a different culture. I'm not his rightful liege. This is ridiculous. He still doesn't want to. Look, mate, I will conquer you. He's called the Lord of Crows. That's pretty awesome. Oh, he's got... Okay, he's got the territory there as well. Interesting. But we're gonna take this. Okay, we're gonna conquer his, uh... The Duchy of Gur. Alright, that's two wars at once. Not usually a good idea, but it's not two fronts, because they're literally right next to each other. I think we'll be okay. Where's my goddamn rally point? No, seriously, where's my rally point? I put it in Merv. Where's Merv? Merv is gone, okay. Fair enough. No, it's here, alright. Well, I guess we'll raise the whole damn legion again. Um, yeah, where's my, uh, where's my elite army? Do you have anything of note? No, right? You're my men-at-arms. Yeah, you have my, uh, catapults, huh? Can I break off the levees? I really wish there was, like, an easy way. Yeah. Let's break them off. And all of the knights. No, go away, levies. We don't want you. Okay. Just... Can, can we not? Oh my god, this is annoying. This is very annoying. Alright, we select that. We go and move down to here. Alright, you. Let's do it again. Split off new army. Oh my god. Have to do it all like this. Nope, we can do it like this. Look at that. The technology! Right. Because we don't need 8 million levies. I need small, a small high quality army. And that should do the trick. I would like it if I could just like... Um, summon? I know that's not the right word. Hold on, hold on, hold on. You have, you have 4,000 men. Yeah, uh, hold your horses here. Let's let's raise up the local army. Fine, we'll do this. We'll add some more levies to it. 
Oh, it's going to take forever because we disbanded them. And, uh, I mean, we can call in the Holy Order. No, we can't. They've already been hired. All right. Yeah. Okay, forget it. It's going to take too long. we got to win this war. All right, let's, let's go beat these guys, and then we'll go and take, uh, this place, whatever it's called. No? They want to run away? That's fine. Oh, we might be able to... Oh, goodbye. Goodbye. Do we have prisoners? Yeah, we got some prisoners. What about you? You have a prowess of eight. You also have a prowess of eight. Psh. Get them in prison for now. Yep, we should win that pretty handily. Whoa, 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 whoa. Who's leading this army? Okay. Looked like my son for a second. I was like, no, that, that, that cannot be. High Medieval Era! Here we go! Now we're talking. Alright. What are we gonna get? First things first. What do we need for primogeniture? Because my god, I... Uh, it doesn't... Scoot it? No. Um, it's all feudal. Divine right? I wish it just... Goddamn said it. Was it... Oh, is that... Is that it? Yeah, hold on just a sec here. Can I... Can I already switch to this? Do we already have the law for this? So it's kind of implying that there's... We already have the law for it, so let's just sway her. And then feasibly, we can switch to primogeniture and be done with this whole shenanigan of the Empire getting split up. Or our territories getting split up. Um... Yeah, let's invest, for sure, in Mangislak. That'll be worthwhile. Um, holding taxes and extra piety. Ooh, that's good. A quick profit? No. Let's go with the piety. Um, Cyrus is going to be more pious than Renisa, that's for sure. Renisa hasn't been the most pious of um, rulers, having had several extramarital affairs. Um, interesting. I could gain Herbalist or Seeker of Knowledge, plus one Learning, or I could sell them. Uh, honestly, I'm so old. Like, if I was a younger character, I would uh, definitely take the traits, but I am not a younger character. All right, this territory is now mine. Thank you. And uh, we're going to deal with this little army here, and then we'll take their capital, and that should probably be... Uh, the end. Wow, we are so fast. It is crazy. What? Why are you? Why are we so fast? You have aggressive attacker. Yeah, and holy warrior. I mean, that, that's not representing the speed. But hold on, just a second. What do we need? Oh boy. Okay, okay. Let's finish this war because we might be able to found another holy order, which would be awesome. Uh, we took a shake captive. He's got to be worth something. Right. Well, actually, hold on, hold on. You're Shake. Which means... Oh, we got lots of captives. Yeah, you're, you're the Shake of Jubine, which... Is that here? Is Jubine here? A ju that's... Okay, a Shake is... Yeah, it is a county title. Okay, that's over there. That's fine. Uh, we'll ransom you. 50 gold. What about you? We'll ransom her. She's Manichaean anyways. She shouldn't even be in here. I mean, I know why she's in here. Because we conquered fellow Manichaeans. Because they did not submit to our rule. The Manichaeanism needs to be united under one rule. That's how it has to be. Cyrus is going to have to do the same thing. Once he comes of age. Well, we've captured another guy. He's a, uh, a Wali. What kind of ransom can we get? 30 gold? Why the hell not? What is this? Oh, he's a eunuch. Okay. Oh, that's fine. Very nice. We have 
Again, an unreasonable amount of gold. Let's uh, upgrade our castles to tier 2. Can we upgrade tier 3 already? No, not, not quite. We do not have hoardings innovation. Speaking of innovations, I was doing something with that. Let's, uh, let's make sure we get the right thing. What would be a good thing to get? I mean, more men-at-arms would be nice. Better knights? Would be good. Castle baileys? Pretty good. Hoardings? Yeah, that would allow us to unlock level 3 castles. Or advanced bow making. Can recruit crossbowmen as men at arms? Interesting. Um, windmills? What are we, the Netherlands? We don't want that. Oh, guilds. Okay, plus one domain limit. That could be good. Or urbanization? Okay, that increases development. This increases vassal limit. Reduces men at arms maintenance. Reduces the levy size. Allows us to... Yeah, you know what? High centralization doesn't sound like a bad idea. Oh, hold on, hold on. House partition. Or high partition. And house seniority. No, but this still isn't... Yeah, it's... It's still not, uh... What do we call it? Gavelkind. But I think... I can switch to Gavelkind. Once she has been swayed. Let's see. Is she swayed now? She should be. Yeah. Like, what's the damn issue? All of these. It just doesn't say why. That is very annoying. Is it something that a clan cannot? Like, is it because our government type is, is clan? Yeah, we are a clan tier. <laughs> or, we are a clan uh, government. Is that is that why? We need the primogeniture innovation. Where the hell do we get primogeniture? Don't tell me it's down here in like one of the forbidden ones. The forbidden ones. No. Is it late medieval? It's not. Yes, it is. Okay. Question answered. I'm assuming that's what's required for the primogeniture law. So, yeah. Well, tough shit. I guess we gotta deal with this for another couple of centuries. Probably just a century. Popular figurehead? Popular opinion? We do, uh, War Profiteer? No, let's get more money. Get as much money as possible, develop the realm as much as possible. Holy crap, I, we didn't spend our money. Just looking at it like, why are we so rich? I was like, oh yeah, we gotta, we gotta actually spend the money. Um, but yeah, all of these castles are at level 2, which is, which is good. What about upgrading, uh, the next territory down, Kizil Su? Hmm? Yeah, let's get this tier 2 castle. And we can create... What do we make here? I mean, you're a coastal settlement, right? Young... Young Gaza? No, you're not really coastal. Oh, man. Garabascal also just, like, super filled with stuff. I love it. We, we have so much stuff. Let's build pastoral... Yeah. Just, just get cows everywhere. Our cows will blot out the sun. Some more levies. Um, what's going on? I think we won. Yeah, we won. Uh, this guy. We need to... Remove his title. Because otherwise he's going to be a huge problem. Or... Hold on. Renounce his... Loses his claim on... No, I don't care about that. Demand conversion? He's not going to convert. But we could execute him. As I have a fair reason, no one will think me a tyrant. I mean, what's his skill? Or his... He's shy. He's gluttonous. He's forgiving. Alright, we're not going to execute him. Okay, we're just going to win the war. Enforce the demands. We will... Does this release him from our prison? That's... Yeah. <sighs> he's still in a mirror. What do you mean he's still in a mirror? No, he's not. Okay, this is all mine. Right. Alright. Um... Yeah. Let's see. So we gotta figure out what to do with this territory. We gotta give it to somebody. But who? 
Um, hmm. No, look at that. We've, we've done some more expansion. Okay. Uh, yeah, we gotta give this away. What is the de jure? Yeah, the Emirate of Gur, which we will usurp. Thank you. That will be mine. I am now the Satrap of Gur. Yeah, okay, so... Um, yeah, who do we give it to? We gotta give it to somebody. You like me. Ah, oh, because you're Manichaean. Oh, you'll join me if I... Okay. Alright, alright. She'll join me. Uh, don't sway her. Not yet. We'll just pay her off and then she'll join us. We've got just unreasonable amounts of money. Um, I have discovered that Marsban House inherited contract obliges her to have more than you have collected. I have to write this wrong. Yes, please. Increase the feudal taxes. Good, good, good. I like that very much. We can disband the armies. Just rake in unfathomable amounts of wealth yet again. And again, we need to get rid of this territory. And, uh... But to who? Yeah, you already have territory. Now you're just an Arkbad. That's it, right? Yeah, but you're you're not really like capable, unfortunately. Yeah. Who do I give this to? So, is this part of a new kingdom? This would be part of the Shariorid. So yeah, Khorasan. Right. So, in that case, I can give this to this guy. Congrats, buddy. I'm giving you the entire satrapy of Gur and all of its associated titles. There you go. Enjoy. We'll, uh, we'll make him the, uh, the new Shah of Khorasan, because this guy, he doesn't want to submit, which is a crying shame. All right. Now you. That's just dumb. Oh, I should have kept the title. Ah! I would not have expected that to work that way. Like, can't you just be like, become the vassal of my vassal? Why? Why does it have to go directly up to me, to where I now no longer own the title because I gave it off? Ah, uh, that's kind of dumb. I, I, I don't like it. Um, Shazada Mithras could use help. Oh, let's get the money, because again, traits are good, but I'm probably not going to live all that long. So, let's just get all of the money we can, so that we can buy all of the things we can in our holdings. Get pastoral lands. Um, this place is fully upgraded. Yeah, we can get pastoral lands here as well, I think. Oh, no, this is... No, this is not the capital. Um, yeah. Do uh, pastoral lands here, too. Can we upgrade the castle while it's upgrading? No. It's already upgrading there. Okay. So, yeah, I've got these two territories to my name. I also still control Sarikamish. You know, I could build more castles here. I mean, I do like building castles, so that's what we're gonna do. And with the money here, because we have the money here. Oh boy, what can we get? Small plantations. I'm not sure about this. Oh, that's unfortunate. Whatever that was. Uh, I am sure about this. Never mind. Yeah, that's being upgraded. This is being upgraded. Okay. Uh, we'll save the money, and then we'll accept the invitation. Yeah, we can go to her feast, all right? Our court dwarf. We've we've made amends with our court dwarf. She, she likes us again. You know, a fat heaping of wealth. I mean... Name one instance where somebody gives you a... Well, there's probably plenty of instances. Um, but name... Uh, yeah, never mind. Just forget it. I was gonna say, name one instance where somebody giving you a ton of money won't make you like them less. Um, but I'm sure they exist. Uh, in fact, I can imagine plenty of instances where 
<laughs> that would not make me like somebody more, but hey. Uh, yeah, good workout. Good. My counselor! Ah, oh, my dwarf! Just when I was starting to like her. She died. Do we have any other dwarfs? Damn it. Where's Moria? Wait, no, there's no dwarfs in Moria anymore. They're all dead. Uh, where do we find dwarfs these days? Sorry, sorry, sorry. Tasteless joke, I know. Gets the better of me. Uh, nip in the air. Um, I am visiting some of the peasants nearby to better gauge how things are going in my realm, or at least pretend I care. I ask one of them how they expect the next harvest to go. There's a nip in the air, the farmer says in his rustic dialect. Cold won't be good for me crops. Uh, don't worry, things will be fine. Yes, let's pray. Gotta have the illusion of piety, at least. What's going on here? Prisoners can be ransomed. Yeah, we should pr ransom some prisoners. Let's ransom her. Oh, we can demand payments from people, too. Hold on. Are you a feudal vassal? No, you're not. I mean, I got a hook on you. We can do all kinds of stuff with the hook. I'm not gonna... Definitely not taking his... Well, let's actually treat his illness first. I mean... Yeah, he's... This is standard treatment. Why did it just switch to you? Because oh, you're the uh, court physician, of course. Um, I can ransom you. Yeah, do it. Get the money. Some marzabans. Yeah, we'll, uh, we'll extort them. Satrap, sure thing, no problem. We'll extort him. Shazada, you are... I don't care. Extort you for money. Look at that, we are getting so much money. It is wonderful. Titles can be created, huh? The Duchy of Balk? Okay. Um, alright, alright. Yeah, do it. And we'll create the Duchy of Guazhou. Guazhou? Guazhou? I don't know. I don't speak Chinese. I don't know the name of that. I don't know how to pronounce it, at least. Uh, Balk. 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 You just made it. Where is it? Can we please see it somewhere? Attribute of his boy. Wait, where where is this attribute of his boy? That's uh, yeah, Sutter Commission his boy. Okay, that is territory I do own, mostly. I do not own his boy itself, but I own Sutter Commission, which is good enough for me. Um, bulk. That's what I was looking for. I'm gonna keep my mind on track. It's difficult sometimes. Where the fuck is it? There we go. Where are you? There you are. Uh, okay. Who rules here? More pertinently, who is of our dynasty that rules here? You're of our dynasty. Congrats. You are now the satrap. Unless the other guy is also ruling here. Who rules in East Tukharistan? You of our dynasty? You are not. So, it's going to be you. We've got to make sure our dynasty rules as much as possible. So he will be the satrap of Balkh. Yep, yep, yep. Grant that. And, um, great. Congrats. Uh, we can demand more payments. Yeah, hell yeah. Just get all these payments. Because I'm going to die soon, I don't think I need this hook. Like, just, just spend it. Get the money. Material gain. Who needs anything else, right? Let's, uh, Guajau. That's, I guess, up here. Yeah, all right. We'll make that. Indeed, create it. See who's, uh, who's out here. Hey, we got vassals. They're Han. And they're Manichaean. It's my brother-in-law. You're Kundid. Not quite of our dynasty. You're also Kundid. Not quite of our dynasty. I like your... You're compassionate. Don't die. I'm giving you the... I'm giving you... Guajal. Okay? Yeah. Take it! It's yours! You are now a satrap! Also a Shazada. Which is a prince. Now... Yeah, right. I already looked at that. Fabricate claims. Psh! I don't need claims. I can take what I want through conquest. Speaking of conquest... We haven't done any conquest in a good while. It's been at least a year. So I don't even know if it's been a year, but... There's these guys. 
Do I leave this to Cyrus? I'm an old woman. I mean, there's nothing saying that... There's nothing stating that an old woman shouldn't be allowed to, you know, conquer vast swaths of territory. Maybe I should focus on developing the realm a little bit more to ensure that our realm is super strong. Let's upgrade these trade ports, get the just the trade ports that are going to be uh, unrivaled on the Caspian Sea, though that's probably not too difficult these days to be unrivaled on the Caspian Sea. Uh, let's see. Patience. Being a very down-to-earth person, I actually would agree. She is quite down-to-earth. I always try to hear others' opinions before making a decision, because every opinion is flawed. Might as well hear them all. <laughs> Cynical mood. Everyone deserves to be heard, no matter who they are. Eh, boring. I am such a great and unmatched ruler. No. Um, every opinion is flawed. <laughs> it's true. Every opinion is flawed. One way or another. Faction starting me have disbanded. Let's see if there's any other factions around. Yeah, there's an independence faction from... Of Zungaria. Where the hell... It... What is this kingdom? No, really, where is this? And how did I come to own it? Okay, so somebody else conquered up here and founded Zungaria. Mate! Fall in line. Our strategy of bribe them <laughs> is working wonders. <laughs> Ah, my counselors are dying. What would this game be without my counselors dying in droves? Holy crap, you have a good prowess. Yeah. Yeah, you have a good prowess. Not gonna lie. Uh, what else can we do these days? Okay, I can't create a holy order. Yeah, because I'm missing money. We gotta... Okay, that's what we're gonna get. We're gonna get that. Okay. Uh, okay, we'll get, we'll get popular figurehead. Ah, meritocracy. That's that's the the thing that I could have used to claim the throne peacefully, according to um, somebody in my comments. God damn, I need to start learning people's names. Aside from uh, the few that comment quite regularly, like liberal socialist. Uh, let's see. I hereby invite you to a feast at my court in Good Gunch. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Of course, I'll go to a feast. Yes, yes, yes. Don't vomit on my shirt. Wait, are you my spy master? No, alright. You're not vomiting on my shirt anyways. We are, yeah, good. Getting more friends with her. We're best buddies now. You know, I I took a significant portion of her kingdom so that I could form my own kingdom and then I seized the imperial throne and gave her all of her territory back. It's an interesting, you know, it's a cool way of doing things. Uh, I don't know. Her disputed heritage. <sighs> What do you mean, disputed heritage? It's my daughter. Um. Excuse me? What is this? How would... How would that even work? Like, it's my daughter. I... <laughs> I created... It's not like with a man, you know, sure, there's, there's, there could be instances where maybe you're not certain. Like, if you're the mother, why is this a secret to me? <laughs> well, whatever. Uh, I'm not gonna blackmail her. Um, you gained a trait. Eager reveler, nice. <laughs> we're getting old and we're coming, becoming a partier. <laughs> Never too late to start partying, right? Uh, I guess I'll get around to it at some someday. No, I probably won't. I I, I hate partying. It, it, in person, in real life. I detest parties. Um. Okay, okay. Found the Holy Order. What are we missing? You do not fulfill the requirements. What bloody requirements? Level of devotion is devoted servant or above. How close are we? Mm, we're very far. Okay, it's probably not going to happen. Unfortunate. I wanted to. Um, oh, we can convert. Oh, that's cool. All right. You can straight up convert territories into... Ne I said necropolises. You know what? We're going to go with that. We can convert territories into necropolises. Speaking of which, I wish there was an option to just, like, raise territories rather than conquer them. I mean, I know it's not beneficial or anything. I'm just saying it would be cool if that was an option. 
because then you could basically play like obviously he's in a different time period uh, he's a couple hundred years later than the scope of this game but then you could be like tumor of the lame style and just obliterate the civilizations that defy you ah uh, good they've abandoned a scheme against me uh spouse claim of convenience my husband kinke eagerly brings a woman before me okay the tikana of le um where is that mm, a little bit too far out And you're not particularly useful to me, so you can be on your way. I'm not super concerned about conquering that. God damn it, more factions! What do you want? Why do you not like me? Attempt to heal wounds. Use the best treatment. I don't again to like me. We're just outsourcing our doctor. Basically. Excellent. Gains 10 opinion of me. Very good. You're not banning your scheme. Do I need to... Do I need to bribe you? Ah, we'll convert you to witchcraft. That should solve things. We're gonna have all of the, uh... The kings, at least, be witches. I've, I've been forgetting about this. I need to get on this more. Merv? Merv. Ah, Merv. Merv, of course. Right, you rule there. And you rule here. That might cause problems. Because this is technically not part of the Kingdom of Coruscant. Never mind. I am a filthy liar. No, it's not part of the Kingdom of Coruscant. This is de jure part of Transoxiana. Well, okay. If Transoxiana de jure loses one title because of to avoid some border gore. You know, it is what it is. We must avoid the border gore at all costs. There can be no compromises and matters that are that serious. Um, yeah, you're, you're scheming against me, huh? Who are you? Who the hell are you? You're some lowborn. Get in my dungeon. I'm gonna go prowling around my lands on an ounce. Speaking of which, I've got like millions of prisoners. Um, wait, you're a Russian. You're a Russian Norse? What the hell? Um, what do we do with all these guys? I mean, we could execute them all. Or, we could see if there's any worthwhile knights. Not really. No. No. Yep, we're gonna burn people at the stake. Um, you, we might ransom. Yeah, ten gold. Fine. If you can pay for your ransom, I won't execute you. That's fair. Um, you, unfortunately, do not uh, have the money. And, uh, well, you can. You might get ransom. Nope. All right. Sorry. Everyone dead. Nice mass stake burning. Very good. Very good. And you. Yeah. Execute him. Can't trust people that are mapping out our lands. Uh, the earthworm. While traveling down the road, we encounter something long, thin, and seemingly slimy on the road. I tell my guards to wait, and I approach and kneel down next to the object. After some careful observation, I realize it is an earthworm, struggling to get to the other side of the road under the heat of the sun. I'll help it out. I might execute people, but I will be nice to earthworms. Okay? We have standards. We are not unkind to invertebrates. Not here. Not on this channel. Right, what do we do? We can build something here. Camelry, yeah, more knights. We never have too many knights. We can afford 19 knights. Oh, and we can do this now. Men at arms, yeah. We should get more. We should definitely get more, especially since we can afford a maximum of like 10. But at this point, do we need that many? I feel like I should build up the economic infrastructure and then do that. 
Just like have maximized economic infrastructure, especially for when my son gets in power, because he's gonna need a lot of money to bribe people. To be on his side. So, I, I feel like that's worthwhile to do. In the meantime, we'll also get more knights. We can afford 21 knights, which will be uh, pretty ridiculous, all things considered. Yes, good, good. Become a witch. Who else is not a witch? Are you a witch? You're not a witch. We should, we should fix that. Join us. What do we do with all this prestige? Yeah, we'll be nice to the commoners. No! Dying of cancer? That's not allowed. Yeah, convert. Yeah, we gotta... We gotta stabilize some territories. Um, yeah, let's work on stabilizing the region, actually. Gotta do something useful with our time. Scheme at court! Somebody's trying to kill my daughter, Gonche. Okay, well, whoever's trying to kill her, I'm going to kill. Just on principle. They will die. What's wrong with you? You're ill. Don't be ill. Treat her illness. Use the best treatment available, indeed. It's our spy master. She's a very good spy master. Good. Good. She's feeling better. And she likes us more. We are magnanimous. Not to our enemies, but to our allies. Those of our realm. If anybody has grievances, like you, we bribe them. Divided attention. Oh my god, more domain limit. It's gonna get ridiculous, but I won't be able to sustain it. That's the problem. Like, as soon as Cyrus comes in power, we're gonna have to give up some of our domain. Um, so, I'm probably not going to immediately make use of that. But I could build more castles. I do like castles. I think I've mentioned this a few times. Build another camelry, get more knights. Uh, what can we do? We can... Let's, let's focus on our core region. Just in case we ever have to, like, get rid of stuff. Um... Yeah, let's upgrade upgrade the city's uh, trade ports. Good, good, good. More witches. Excellent. Um, are you a witch? You're not a witch. You want to be a witch? Yeah, it looks like you want to be a witch. Very good. Praise the father of darkness. We may be vassals of a... Uh, or we may be uh, seeking perfection in the great beyond, but here in this mortal world, this world is created by sin, and there's no region then there's no reason that we cannot indulge in that sin while we are here. We will simply have to go undergo purification. Uh, we can create another duchy of... that sounds like a Mongolian name. Are we conquering Mongolia? That would be hilarious. Yeah, looks like we are. Let's create this duchy. Alright. Uh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Very nice. Okay. Uh, who's gonna get it though? So let's let's just give it to the uh, let's just give it to the king. Yeah, we're gonna give you uh, the duchy of the satrapy of Gurban Tungut, I think. Gurban Tungut, Tungut. Uh, I don't I don't know how to do the U with the two dots, but I think it is. Is it Mongolian? I don't know. Hell yeah, now he likes me. Stop scheming against me. What's the culture? Kyrgyz. Okay. Yeah, that's not... Ah, Altai. Nice, look at that. Our vassals are expanding on their own. Which is great. We are looking pretty mighty, I must say. Hmm. Italy. Yes, that's where Italy is. <laughs> 
that's where Brittany is also. Hold on, we gotta we gotta check on how the uh, the Mandaeans are doing in Scandinavia. You guys still Mandaeans? Oh, now they're now they're Cabarites. <laughs> the Jewish Sweden. <laughs> what the hell happened up there? All right, the servant of patricians. The servants of the patricians has been established in Ishtikhan by Matriarch Renisa. Nice. That's the second holy order. Look at that. Two Manichaean holy orders. Awesome. I wish I could just like voluntarily. Oh, right, again, another grand mistress. Huh, very cool. Servants of the Patricians. Interesting name. Probably not the one I would have chosen, but it's alright. They do have some very cool names, for sure. Like, the Army of Light. That's just badass. Welcome to our communion, brother. Alright. Are you a witch? You're a witch. Very good. Man of... You're a witch. Kotan? You're a witch. Zungaria, you're not a witch. Are you of my dynasty? You are. You should be a witch. Join us. Yes. Faction created against me by populists. Whatever. Peasants. Filthy. Oh my god, how many earthworms do we need to help across the road? What is this? The great earthworm migration of 1127? You can read about it in the scientific books. Trust me. I, I was a biologist. I know this stuff. And let this be a lesson of why you should never trust people on YouTube. Watch there actually have been an earthworm migration in 1127. And I'll just be both right and wrong at the same time and an utter fool for it. Yep. Upgrade the trade ports. Let's get all of that trading. Build up those fishing fleets. Or trading fleets. I'm sure that they also have fishing fleets. Oh, yeah, here we go. Select the congenital traits. Oh, boy, what are we going to get? What do we want? Do we want the intelligence? Or wait, why would you ever select, like, okay, I guess, okay. All right. Uh, yeah, we'll help you. Give me just a sec. Why would you want, I mean, I can understand wanting giant. <laughs> the other ones? I don't know. Okay, albino would be kind of cool. For sure. Let's pick hail. More healthy. It seems good. We don't want octogenarians. I don't want to live that long. Then we'll just have, like, super old heirs. Who admittedly will also maybe live longer, but... Alright, who are we fighting? We are fighting against... Oh, against the Chowda. We used to be friends with the Chowda. Friends no longer. Alright. Well... I mean... We'll, we'll honor the arrangement. We can get some... Really? Do we want to arrange... Do we want to, though? Honestly, I don't care. And honestly, I want to break my alliance with Hemavati at some point so that I can take this damn holy site. No, no, no. Let them weaken themselves. We'll be there in spirit, cheering them on. Yeah. Lithuania! Mate. What are you... Hellas! This... Hellas being all in and up around here is more reasonable, considering they've actually done this in, in the past. You know, you had the, the, the Black Sea colonies, like uh, Colchis and Cimmeria, and all that type of stuff. Lithuania, um... I mean, they made it to the Black Sea, but I don't think they made it to nearly, to almost to the Caspian Sea before. Uh, <laughs> I don't know what's happening anymore. It's all a mess. Where's is there an actual Lithuania? Yeah, there is. <laughs> but you have one territory all the way out here. <laughs> oh my god, it's ridiculous. There's some serious border gore happening. Is France still Muslim? Yep. <laughs> It's like the same parts of France are still Muslim, also. <laughs> Aquitaine. Yep, yep, yep. <laughs> uh. 
This is a wild world. I'm not gonna lie. Oh my god, we have so much money. It just never stops. Upgrade the castle. We gotta do something with all this. Wrong chamber! Oh no! He didn't want to join. That's... that's a... that's a crying shame. We need to find other people to potentially convert to witchcraft. Yeah, you're not a witch. Let's fix that. I want to find that witch coven, you know? That sounds like fun. We're only at 16.2%. Jesus. It's going to take a long time. Uh, okay. Notable guest. Um, what's notable about you exactly? You seem just dead average. You have a claim on Zela. What the hell is Zela? A little bit out of my reach. Just saying. Let's work off some stress. Very good. Develop the capital. I'm not raising the armies. Don't particularly care. I'm confident they'll be able to win this on their own. New stewardship lifestyle perk. Let's get architect. Nice. So architect gives us, well, the architect trait for one. Oh man, that's gonna be good. During these last years of our life. Ah, uh, okay, okay. We were just raided. That. I'm not standing for. No, no, no. We're not okay with that. I will expend great resources to ensure that this does not happen. Alright, who, who the fuck just raided me? Atirao. Look at him. Just an absolute chungus. It's a dishonorable grasper, yeah. Okay, we probably don't need all of these to punish some raiders. Just, just saying, I, I don't think we need this massive of an army. Loathsome Fiend. Huh? The Chieftain... Of... The Chieftain of what? Oh, he's got a claim on the Chieftain of Omsk, huh? You in my territory? You're being hosted by... Some lady. He's trying to murder my, uh, my daughter. We're gonna murder him. We, uh, we don't allow this type of stuff to happen. I don't know if it's going to be successful, but I will have my spy master start supporting schemes. We'll see if we can get rid of this asshole. He tried to murder my daughter. We cannot abide by that. All right. Um, I wish there was just a raid them back option. That'd be great. But, alas, not our culture. We don't, we don't do raiding. Which is just sad. All right, let's annihilate them. Just utterly obliterate this army. Very good. Pay a hunter to draw a map. Explore the taiga myself. Ah, oh, I could do that. I'll do it myself. I tried to murder my daughter. That makes it personal. Um, convert the betrothal into a marriage. This will land us a, an inferior alliance with Jishia. That's fine. I don't care. It's matrilineal anyway, so she'll stick around. Bonche. Can we, like, just... Well, what else can we do? Can we obliterate more of their, uh... Because, I, I don't know. I just want to destroy them. And, like, just utterly lay waste to their entire civilization. Because they raided me. That's that's what I want. Demand payment? No. We, we don't get much money from you. A few Aswaran? What do you mean, few Aswaran? We have fucking 19 of them. 
I don't know what makes you think that's few. Let's do the reasonable thing and get more cataphracts. All right. Um, okay, I guess we're done with our retribution campaign. Which is a shame. I enjoyed our retribution campaign. Feels good to uh, lay waste to those who defy us or cause us problems. Which they certainly did. They raided us. In fact, uh, how, how is that looking? No, we'll, we'll wait on that. Um, regular habits. Watch him at all hours. Yes. Good. We must kill him. Before he kills anybody in our court. Or before he kills anybody in our family. Uh, hold on. We have a situation here. And the situation is... This guy is an absolute Chad. Yeah. Look, I'm very sorry, Satrap Tear, but... Don't worry. Wait. What happened? Hold up. Why didn't that work? Oh, because we did that. Um, can we switch? You guys? Reassign? Yeah, it's unfortunate, but we're going to have to move you back up to there then. There you go. We'll get you your, uh, we'll get you your stuff back. Don't worry. Actually, he doesn't need it. Whereas this guy does, but he doesn't have as good of skills. Uh, so we're gonna we're gonna keep him there. Um, let's see here. We, you're still the best. Yeah, you're still the best. You still the best. Yep. <laughs> I'm assuming you're the best. <laughs> you're fucking forty nine. <laughs> forty nine learning. Oh my god. All right. Uh, as much as I love my sister. Um, this guy's going to be a better tax collector, and he's a satrap. Your prowess is 18. What's your prowess? 20. You are now... I hope you're not afraid of spiders. My cupbearer. Cupbearer is my son. Yeah. Uninvited. Excellent. Now, he is dead. Daughter, you can rest easily. What's our time? 58 minutes? That's fine. We'll go a little bit longer. Get more money and build more things. And we're still just getting, like, an unfathomable amount of money. We've got a lot of cataphracts. Just want to point that out. Like, yeah, uh, okay, it's only 250. Well, now it will be 350. Which is reasonable. That's an amount of cataphracts that I'm okay with. I'd like to have that many in real life. Personally. So, if we have ten stacks here... We could... And it's it's 500 per stack. We can get seven men-at-arms. That could be a total of 3,500 cataphracts. Which does seem like a pretty solid... Like, life goal run an army of 3,000 cataphracts. I'm like, fuck unit countering. We don't care about that. We, we'll have 3,000 cataphracts, and we'll just laugh as the rest of the world cries. I mean, look at the stat differences here. This is the light horseman. They have 29, 15, 43. Admittedly, it's a, it's a retinue size 4. Um, <laughs> but does, does the retinue size actually matter? No, right? No. That, that's not affecting this. So it's, yeah, it's... <laughs> 29 versus 120. 45 armor versus 15. 15 pursuit versus 43. So yeah, they are better at pursuit. And 20 screen versus 30 screen. Indeed, light cavalry are a bit more mobile than cataphracts. Uh, and in fact, we should have some light cavalry. I mean, we are Persians. Persians did the whole light cavalry business quite well. I mean, realistically, we should be able to recruit horse archers. 
Especially as the Sogdians. I don't know. I foresee the end coming. I'm now infirm. That is unfortunate. Use the best treatment. Yeah, I'll go into debt for like a minute. No, okay. Um, I'll use the standard treatment now, I guess. No! I'm not ready to go. Well, if I go... We'll end the episode with the coronation of Cyrus. We better become known as Cyrus the Great. Exercise in mediation. Yeah, so there's some squabbling vassals. Um, yeah, we wanna we wanna have this guy like us. Well, actually, no, it doesn't really matter. New lifestyle perk, wonderful. That'll last us for a very long time, I'm sure. Um, let's get war profiteer. Because I think we'll, I think we're gonna be dead in like a year, probably not too much longer. I would imagine. Oh my god, maximum maximum grade cataphracts. Well, once again, I am fucking flawless at predicting when I'm gonna die. <laughs> If there is something I am good at in this game, it is that. Alright, we continue as Shahanshah Cyrus. Long live the Shahanshah. I'm going to quickly take a look at what our situation is. Okay, so we've gone down Seducer. That I'm not a fan of. Unless there's, like, particularly good traits. Oh, man. No, this just isn't good. I'm going to reset the perks. It's going to be a lot of stress. Ooh, overwhelmed by stress. So that gives me six perk points. Will I gain... Do they all go in here? Why can't I spend them? Mental break. Dark thoughts. What am I going to do? Alright, we're going to be a flagellant. That's fine. We've got an ultra... Um, doctor. So, we should be okay, right? We still have her? Wonderful. Um, yeah, we are well over our realm limit. So we're gonna have to give out some territories, which hurts my soul. Not gonna lie, it hurts my soul. What is this? Where is this? Oh, really? What are, what are we doing? How did we even get this? Did somebody else get this? giving it to this guy. Right? You're the satrap here? Yeah, you're the satrap of Merv. You can have Bakdis. Bakdis. Right? And you can have Abivard. You can have both of them. Alright? They're all yours. Congrats, mate. Now you like me. Um, what other territories do we have? We have... An arg that is here? Yeah, 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 yeah. Yeah, we keep that. I think these are all just the... Ustjurt? Yeah, I think we keep that. Right. Mars Panet. Do we keep it? Actually? I think so. I think we should keep it. Reading post. Yeah. It's got useful stuff. Uh, okay. We definitely... Oh, God. Why does it do this? Um, Alright, we need to... Man, he's just too good. Not to put in a position of power. Kinke, uh, no, we're gonna put the Shah in here. Right? You are going to assist me with politics. I think I'll need to help all the help I can get. Um, you are a Shazade. You know, you're ridiculously good. Spymaster stays as she is. Uh, I cannot be my own cupbearer anymore, unfortunately. So we are going to... So potentially... 
Uh, Kinke, maybe? Or let's have this... No, you're going to be the high almoner, for sure. What? There's somebody with a better learning score? How is this humanly possible? You have 53 learning. And you're only 37 years old. That's insane. Alright, but I have to give it to him. That's madness. Uh, I'm going to make him Master of Horse, because he wants the title more. I want to make him the Tax Collector. I think I will. Can we, do we have a Court Dwarf? No, and we still need a Cupbearer. Preferably one that likes us. Uh, you'll like us more when we make you our Cupbearer. So I think that's all fine. But alright, everybody. I think uh, this is probably a good place to call the uh, the session, the video. So we'll continue on next time with uh, Shahanshah Cyrus. And we'll see what he can do for Manichaeanism and for the Great Empire. Alright guys, if you've enjoyed it, like the video. And I'll catch you all next time. See you later.